Welcome everybody, this is your boy Gerardo Matoro and we are here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, this video is all about the single player garage in your single player. So like always, make sure you download and install all of your latest requirements that's inside my description below. And once you guys have completed that, then I will leave this mod inside my description as well. So make sure you guys do download this mod. Once you guys have completed that process, then all you guys got to do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open the file location. Now, as you guys can see, I have already installed my requirements, so I don't need to install them for use. Once you guys are inside your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, go to your scripts folder, and make sure you got the latest native UI.dll file inside your scripts folder as well. Open up your SPGR extract folder and inside that folder there will be another SPGR folder inside the extract folder. Open up that folder and there will be a few folders and files in here. All you guys got to do is just select all the files and folders inside the extract folder then I click on it and drag it into your scripts folder and that's all you guys gotta do wait until it's completed then exit out of your extract folder go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder right click refresh exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and I'll see you guys in the game and we are back as fragment so as you guys can see when you go onto your map there will be a few garages, okay? Guys, remember, it's only garage, okay? So, it's not the um, house or the mansion, okay? So, it's not the business or house or mansion. It is just the garage, okay? So, as you guys can see, that, that the garage inside the arena walls is there. It's, there's garages over here. There's a garage over here. Garage over here, yeah. Um, garage over here. There's multiple garages in and around all around the map. Okay, guys, so you just need to go and find them But the garage that I'm going to go in and test is this one over here Now before you guys go inside the garage There's one big rule you must do and we all should know what is that and that is enable your MP maps so to enable your MP maps all you guys gotta do is press F4. Then just scroll down to teleporting and then go down to other teleports over here at the end. Then just scroll down in the middle and then it will say enable NP maps. Then now just enable it and just wait for a few seconds. Your game will freeze for only a few seconds, okay? So let's just wait for a few seconds and there we go and now it's done. Now you are free to go inside the garage. All you guys got to do is just go up to the garage with or without a car. Okay, either way guys you can go in there with a car if you want to. So, we, so let's go over here, press E to purchase it and now all you guys got to do is go to garage options enter garage and you can enter the garage uh, with a car if you don't want to enter the garage with a car you can back out back out back out again and press Q to go inside the garage and now you're inside the garage see so there's already vehicles here so yeah uh, there's already cars in here so there is room for two more cars I think yeah two more over here you can sell your cars or you can buy cars over here um, 
yeah, you can sell or buy cards over here, guys. That's totally up to you. And over here, I think this works too. You can go to the internet, yep. So yeah, um, it actually works, guys. So it works perfectly. All you gotta do is drag all the files inside the extract folder into your scripts folder, and that's it. Now let's leave the garage, and there we go. See, easy and simple, guys. So I have already tested all the other garages, so they all work. So I hope you guys do enjoy this mod because I do. So welcome back guys and I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. So it is really really easy guys to install okay. All you guys gotta do, I'm going to repeat myself again one more time. All you guys gotta do is just drag all of the files and folders inside the extract folder into your scripts folder and that's all you guys gotta do. Make sure that you got the latest native UI.dll file inside your scripts folder as well. So that is it for now guys, but if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you guys out. So with that all said guys, I hope you do enjoy this video. If you guys did, please smash the like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and tutorials. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you for watching, peace, and I'm out.